I didn't think Elegant Themes would be able to pull this off. Well, we have it, DV5 Beta. And the plan is to have the final release by the end of the year. I mean, this has been awesome. I had so many doubts because the major features that I didn't think were going to be implemented were implemented and they are working fine. Flexbox, Grid, I mean, those were the two major ones because they are to do with the layout of the website. And there's even way more features that have been added. And I'm impressed. And for those of you that were on the um, sidelines waiting to see if this was going to be a real thing, I think this is proof that they really, really worked really hard to get where they are today. But anyway, so what's going on with this beta? Well, this is a public beta. This is the version before the main final one, which can be used pretty much on any uh, website publicly. But that doesn't mean that it's not usable on uh, new websites or websites that are still in DV4. Well, if you have a website running on DV4, you can migrate it to DV5 easily. No problems. But if you have third party modules that rely on DV4, that, then they might be a problem. But of course, it will run in compatibility mode. I've tested a few uh, plugins and they're working fine, but it's, uh, it's in compatibility mode. But before you do any migration from DV4 to DV5, you need to make sure you back up your websites because uh, you might lose your data. But in fact, you know what? I'm going to do a full tutorial showing you how you can actually do this uh, in a safe way. But before we go into that, let me just show you that officially you can see here on the website, they have a DV5. And if you already have DV5, I mean a DV account, you can go ahead and click on download beta and this will take you into your members area. And here it is. You can just go ahead, download it and start uh, using it. So for those of you that haven't purchased DV yet, I'll leave a link to that in the video description below. And if you do purchase DV using my affiliate link, I'll also give you access to my bonuses, which I'm putting together as we speak. The other thing that I want to talk to you about is Divi now has become very complex, right? Not that it's a bad thing, but it's full of features. Uh, when you take a glance here, you'll notice that we have things like the inspector here that is new. And we also have, if we click here on this plus button, you'll notice that we have our flex equal columns, flex offset columns. I mean, this is all flex box. And if you scroll further down, you're going to start to see that we also have a grid going on here. Again, this is really, really exciting and really, really powerful. Now we can design websites that are really, you know, awesome and has different type of layouts. Whereas in DV4, we were limited. We couldn't do this. Uh, we could only try and hack the system by going into the CSS classes and so on and so forth. But for now, I mean, this is very impressive. Now, the other thing I want to also talk to you about is we have the variables manager. I mean, this is now getting into the area where this is what professional designers use because without variables, it is very difficult to build a consistent looking website, which is easy to maintain. So by adding variables, it just makes things even much better. Now, there's a lot of features I mean, that have been added. There's also the uh, attributes uh, tab here where you can go in and... Um, specify all your attributes and so on. But you know what? In all these features, in fact, uh, DV5 beta actually broke uh, the SiteCrafter framework. So I know it's an update we need to, we, I mean, we're currently working on. For those of you that don't know what it is, uh, the SiteCrafter framework is a um, framework that allows to design uh, websites which are consistent and it's a totally different way of designing websites in Divi. It's a class-based uh, system as compared to, uh, say, the inline way of editing things. So yes, we're working on the update, but here's the good news. I have a course. It's called DV5 Mastery. It's right here. You can see it has 737 uh, students. And this course teaches you at the moment, we have 27 lessons. It teaches you pretty much everything that you need to know about uh, DV5. And this course will get you up and running super fast. Now, the good news is this course is only $27, only $27. So once you purchase that, I'll be adding more lessons to it. And all those lessons, you don't have to pay extra. Um, once you purchase it for $27, 
you'll get all the uh, rest of the lessons as I update the course absolutely free. Now, it's $27 at the moment because, because we are still in beta. Once we get out of beta and I add more lessons, the price is going to increase. So the best time to lock yourself in is right now. Purchase it now and you'll have access to uh, all the future lessons to this course absolutely free. The link to that will be in the video description below. The other thing as well that I want to talk about is DB5, like I said, came a very long way. And uh, in my opinion, I think it's proven that it is a platform which you can rely on. And it is a true contender when it comes to um, fighting for space in the uh, page builder uh, area. And at the moment, it's looking like they are really uh, behind this and it is yeah I mean it is uh, improving a lot and I'm really really impressed because at the moment if we take a look at where it's come from it was not clear whether they were going to have all these features because in DB4 it took such a long time for fe for features to be added and it was just all these minor features which just in my opinion added uh, a lot of uh, a lot of uh, weight to DB5 as well so with, uh, I mean, to DV4. With DV5 where it is right now, I am really impressed. And it gives me that energy for me to continue to build uh, websites using DV. So this is very, very exciting. I'll leave a link to DV5 in the uh, video description below. And also look forward to a lot of tutorials coming very soon. Uh, I'm going to do as much tutorial, as many tutorials as I can and spend as much time as I can in the builder itself to really master it so that I can teach it to you. So when you start uh, using it, it will be much, much easier for you to build websites. Now, I have a list of ready-made websites that uh, you can just uh, click, install, and you're up and running super fast. And they're all going to be based on our SiteCrafter framework, which is very, very easy to maintain. Uh, and also for uh, freelancers and agencies, this is going to be a massive time saver. So I'm really looking forward to that. And uh, also, thank you very much for your support. I mean, I see all the comments. You guys, you know, you watch all my uh, videos and you've been supporting me for a very long time. I'd really appreciate it because without you, I would have probably given up, <laughs> you know. So, yes, I'd like to say thank you so much. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you again in the next one. Take care.